Hi, I'm Dr. Nazanin Hakim. And I'm Dr. Mahsa Hakim. We are sisters, uh, graduated from UCSF in 2004. We have been practicing in the Bay Area as general dentists for over 17 years. Uh, last year during the pandemic, uh, we took a course from Dr. T online and we were very impressed by uh, recommendations he had uh, for our practice. We own a general dental practice called Union Square Dental Practice at 450 Sutter, uh, San Francisco. Recently moved to a new suite uh, with more chairs and more patients. So it was a bad time for us to take the business to the next level. Um, so after uh, taking the course uh, and learning more about uh, the business that Dr. T offers, like dental consulting, we decided to start working with him. Um, we started January 2021, and on the very first month, we saw about 35% increase in our uh, collection. Um, so basically, one of the things Dr. T helped us is to be more efficient with dental coding and insurance coding and the insurance narratives. Um, he also helps us a lot with uh, managing the staff's uh, incentives. Uh, he helps us uh, to add more procedures uh, that we are comfortable with into our dental practice. Uh, he helps us with advertisement, optimization of our uh, search engine, uh, marketing, website, um, and uh, lowering our business costs. Uh, it's been a very, very comprehensive, eye-opening experience with him. Uh, now we're at month five and we are already seeing all the potentials that's opening up to us. So basically, he helped us to increase our production without much adding to our overhead and even in, uh, decreasing our overhead. Yes. He introduced us to new labs, to new equipments. And uh, what I noticed about his approach is that he's very genuine. So he has a, a world of knowledge that he is just ready to uh, provide it to you. You just need to be open and ask him questions and he will help you along the way. Yes, I agree. He's very generous with his knowledge and he's very smart. Yeah, it's been a great pleasure meeting him and we're very happy. Uh, we're re looking forward in the next few months and see what the end of the year of 2021 is going to look like compared to the end of 2020.